Hello community. So what is the best LLM around? And there's a beautiful application I would like to show you. This is called Chatbot Arena. Here two LLMs fight against each other. So let's have a look. We have here my prompt explain in pure scientific terms the fundamental ideas behind quantum field theory and theoretical physics. And now two systems try to analyze it, model A and model B. And I at first do not know what is model A, model, what is model B, but I have to vote. Is A better or B better or is there a tie? And are both bad or which one is more advanced? So it's a blind test that tells you exactly what it is all about. So you see here, for example, between A and B, at least in the length of the answer, there's a clear difference. So let me give me a minute and I have a look at the content here. So we are back and I would definitely say based on the result of my experience, B is better. So you see here, model A was Alpaca 13B and model B was, yeah, of course, GPT's chat GPT, so GPT 3.5 Turbo. So you see, and you got a lot of results in this way. And last week, if you want to now know how you compare, if 5,000 people did this, you have now here a simple notebook. It's a Colab notebook. I give you the link, you can download it. So they have now a specific rating system that they apply. And they say, hey, let's have a look how the two system performed. And of course, it is about theoretical physics. It is about statistic. And you see here, you have your raw data. You have model A. This was here an alpaca 13B. And this was a dolly 12B. And then you see who was the winner, the timestamp and the language it was performed. And you see, you got a lot of data. And if you have in one week, 5,000 uh, comparison, so you have here about 10,000 rows, beautiful. Then you do a little bit of statistics, you do a little bit of cleanup, you do a little bit of mathematics and you say, yippee, I wanna have a look at this in detail. Yes, you can, you can, of course. You ask the pairwise proportion. If you wanna know more about the ELO rating system, Wikipedia has a nice article about it. So if you're interested, no problem at all. And then you have a preliminary rating and then you have the computed ratings. And here we are. And if you want to see this, this is now the result here of last week's model. But of course, you can go here. And if you go here, the leaderboard, here we have now our winners. And we have here the 13 billion, 13 billion and a 12 billion LLM um, places. One, two, and three. Now, just want to tell you to be fair, the whole thing is done by LMSYS and now the first place goes to LMSYS. Uh, okay, this could be a coincidence, but they are very transparent. They give you here all their computation. We have to battle here in the chatbot arena and they really want to find out on the viewer, on the person that is using an LLM, you just saw it, how can we judge it? And it's a, my personal judgment, but I think it is a really interesting result. And I want to show you something particular here. Look, if you go now with here to open assistant with Pythia or we go with Koala. Okay, this is, yeah, marginal, I would say here in the ratings. But there's one, uh, yeah, then you have Alpaca, of course. And then you have two very specific, look, we have here Dolly with 12 billion, and here we have for Meta Llama with 13 billion. So you see, based just on what users wrote in a blind test, Llama is here with 13 billion parameters. So this one that is restricted, that is non-commercial, you're not allowed, you do not get a license. But you see, there are so many other beautiful free opinions. But there's two nice things, or well, one nice thing, look, you have the smallest model is just 3 billion here. And you know what is here with 3 billion the winner? 
flan T5. So highly interesting that if you have now flan T5, which is a fine-tuned T5 by Google, and then you have a chat assistant fine-tuning on this flan T5 by a specific company, since they have this chat data, with the FastJet T5 3 billion parameter model, you get really good results because look, this is 950. And here the place number three is, is 1065. So the difference for a 3 billion parameter to a 12 billion parameter, four times bigger, but it is relatively comparable. So if you have, if you wanna do this on your GPU, at home, and maybe you do not have a 12 billion parameter infrastructure at home, a computer infrastructure, the best 3 billion parameter model on this battleground here is a FLAN T5 that has been now for a chat application, for a chat downstream task, again, fine-tuned on a chat assist fine-tuning. So you see, According to this data last week, this best 3 billion parameter model, Plan T5, 6 billion is here by this university. And then you have more or less Koala or Pitya. If you want to know more about this, where is my Koala? Here is my Dolly if you're interested in it. Here is my Koala. Here is my Alpaca code. I have three videos on the detailed coding on GPT-4. Here is my Stanford Alpaca, and if you want to train Alpaca on the T5 or the Flan T5 model, those here are my two videos for you, if you're interested, and a little bit more, the code and the details. So it gives you a very nice overview. Please participate here in the chatbot arena. Have a look for yourself. Insert here your particular text, your particular topic, your particular language, maybe even. If you're a non-English speaker, have a look what model is best for you. It's a blind test, but if you do this four or five times, you immediately see what is the best available model for you. And it is free and you help the community to get evaluation results based on different application. This was it for today. I hope you learned a little bit and I see you in my next video.